Hi everyone, my name is Peyton Miller and I'm 16 years old and I play professional soccer for the New England Revolution and I currently play for the US U19 national team. Uh, first, I would like to say congrats to Rick and Dave on the retirement and thank you for everything that you've done for everyone and especially me. Um, and I just wanna say that Oakwood was a huge help to my success and it was really, really like my second family. Um, Oakwood helped me extremely with my technical ability and how to compete at the highest level. And I just want to thank Rick and Dave for everything that they've done for me. And congrats. Hi, my name is Ellie Jean and I'm a player in the NWSL, currently playing with Racing Louisville FC in Kentucky. Um, I just wanted to wish Rick and Dave a happy retirement and thank you so much for all that you've done for Oakwood. Um, I know personally for me that I would not be who I am today without Oakwood, um, and I would not be where I am in my career right now without Oakwood. I feel like I grew up there. Um, some of my most favorite memories as a young kid uh, were at the indoor facility or out on the pitch in Glastonbury. Um, and you guys just created su such a wonderful place for local kids to have a really good time, learn new things about the world, about themselves, about being a good teammate, about being a part of a team. Um, and you really gave us the opportunity to just run with that and take our careers where we wanted them to go. Um, and I wanted to thank you because I would not be where I am without you guys today. So I'm wishing you guys such a happy retirement. I'm wishing you guys so much fun on your next adventures. Um, and thank you for all that you've done. And I hope I can continue to pass along um, the legacy that you guys have left. So thank you so much. Enjoy. Rick, Dave, congratulations. What a milestone. The legacy of Oakwood, you can't think but Rick and Dave. You know, uh, to me, Oakwood was more than a sports facility. It was a second home, being from Glastonbury, Connecticut. Uh, a kid that just wanted to compete, that found a home at Oakwood with Rick and Dave, Bob Wasserman, a bunch of other great coaches, great mentors that taught young kids, not just about the sport, but about discipline, grit, grind, and really prepared us for life after soccer. I was fortunate to take the discipline and training to the University of Connecticut we were fortunate to then be coached by an unbelievable individual that had the same grit, discipline, tenacious appetite, competitive spirit to win, like Oakwood. That's what Oakwood builds. It builds champions. It builds disciplined men and women to go out in the workplace. Oakwood will always be in my heart. It is a place where you go to grow. You win, you lose, you yell, you fight. I might've got yelled at more than not. I wasn't the easiest player to coach. I, I know that, Rick. I appreciate you sticking with me. But the smells and the sounds of Oakwood, it's so much more than a sports facility. And I couldn't be more excited for Rick and Dave to write this next chapter of their amazing book. I'm sure Dave still has a six pack. It's kept me motivated to stay fit in my, I won't say my age, but just, you know, a little older these days. But um, I'll close with this. I know my soccer and sports career wouldn't be what it was without Rick and Dave. And that's captain of the 2000 national champions at UConn. And I want to thank you both for the commitment and discipline you have to so many kids that come through and have come through that program. Uh, second to none in the country. And I congratulate you both on this amazing milestone. And for those that may not know me, Max Zeke, kid from Glastonbury, Connecticut, Oakwood and Rick and Dave took a chance on and it's made a world of difference in my life. So congratulations to you both, the Oakwood extended family um, upward and onward, as they say. I look forward to seeing what your next chapter that you both will write, as I know it'll be amazing. Have a great one. Cheers. Rick. Jesse here. Um, 
just want to say congratulations on your retirement and moving forward into the next chapter of your lives. Um, I also want to say thank you for everything that you've done for me specifically. Um, you guys have both been like an extra parent for me growing up and you've given me multiple opportunities and experiences that I don't know if I would have gotten without the two of you. So I really want to say thank you for everything that you've done for me specifically and my family and everybody else that you've helped out. Um, once again, congratulations and good luck. And if you need anything, let me know. Hey, Rick and David's it's Demi. I hope all is well. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to make the in-person event due to ankle surgery. So as you can see, I'm stuck here on the couch. But nevertheless, I want to thank you both for your contributions you've made not only to myself, but to the Oakwood community, Connecticut soccer, the broader U.S. soccer community, and even internationally. Being a part of your success has been an honor, and I'm thankful to have had both of you as coaches and as mentors, not only through my development as a soccer player, but most importantly, through my development as a person. So as you step away, I hope you both are able to enjoy the rewards of all of your hard work with your loved ones and at this event. Thank you for me and my family. Take care. Rick and Dave, just wanted to say congratulations on both of your retirements. Um, I want to thank you for your years of service to Oakwood and all of the hard work and dedication you put in to making everyone's experience as good as it could be. Um, I mean, you shaped thousands of lives on and off the pitch. You taught so many people, not only the game of soccer, but also instilled really important life lessons, such as hard work, dedication, commitment to excellence, teamwork, and I could go on and on about things that um, you taught us. I mean, for me personally, I can 100% say I wouldn't have achieved as much as I have in my career on or off the pitch, you know, whether it was you guys encouraging to get college educations and, you know, to pursue excellence inside and outside of the classroom, um, or just, you know, day in and day out being leaders and examples, you know, shoveling, shoveling fields, um, when you didn't have to doing everything you could to make sure our experience was, you know, as high level as it could be. So for that, I just wanted to thank you guys and, um, really just happy for both of you um and hope that you both enjoy retirement and you know miss you guys and hope i can see you soon congratulations hi rick and dave it's austin reynolds i'm live from socha france hours before our u23 game against thierry Henry's french 23s in our prep for the olympics and i'm obviously really thrilled for this opportunity but when I think of the road that led me to this, it's impossible to not think of Oakwood and the foundations and the skill sets and the values that that you two, Rick and Dave, have instilled in that entire organization from from top to bottom for almost 40 years. And I was fortunate enough to spend four years of such a critical time in my life and in under your umbrella and in, in your homes. So I'm really grateful for everything that Oakwood and you guys have done for me personally. I know there's hundreds and thousands of people all across Connecticut that feel the exact same way. And your legacy on the game is, is everlasting, particularly in the, in the New England area. And it's impossible for um, myself and several others to look back on our accomplishments and not have the foundations of Oakwood uh, as a part of them. Um, so I'm super happy that you guys have been able to move on to the next stage of, of your lives with the, with the new direction that Oakwood is going in. And it's the least that you two deserve for everything you've put into the game over the years and all the time that you've put into to to coaches, players, anyone involved in the in the sport throughout Connecticut and and the United States. So, I wanted to thank you um from the bottom of my heart and I hope you guys celebrate a glorious occasion. Um thank you very much. Hey guys, Max Wasserman here. Uh currently working at Nike for Nike Soccer at the World Headquarters in Beaverton, Oregon. Uh, just wanted to send a quick message saying thank you to Rick and Dave for everything you guys have done for me personally and for the sport of soccer and 
Uh, Oakwood was the second home to me growing up. Um, spent multiple nights a week there, pretty much every weekend there uh, between my brother's games, my dad's games. Um, it was a it was a foundational part of my life in soccer. Still is uh, one of the most important things to me, thanks to what you guys have done for uh, for the sport and for me myself. So, thanks again. Good luck in this next chapter, um, and uh, hope to stay in touch. Hey everyone, this is Ben Applefield. I am currently working as a coach at Inter Miami. Before that, I was doing the same job with DC United. And before that, I was an Oakwood player and an Oakwood coach for about 10 to 15 years in total. Um, I miss a lot of you guys, and I wish I could be there to, to celebrate with you. And when you'll be seeing this, I'll be coaching at a tournament, actually. So in some way, it's a fitting excuse not to be there. Um, but anyway, first, Rick and Dave, I just wanted to say congrats to you guys. For me, what you guys have built and, and created over these years is incredible. And the number of kids and families you guys have positively impacted is pretty special. Um, and I hope you know this by now, uh, but I'll reiterate just in case that for me personally, um, I just continue to be extremely grateful and extremely appreciative for, for the impact you've had in my life and, and kind of what you've done for me. Uh, when I look back at my Oakwood years, there's just so many positive memories and experiences and things that I still laugh about and, and take with me now and, and that I learned and, and, uh, carry with me with who I am as a person and who I am as a coach. So, uh, again, thank you guys so much and wishing you all the best. Talk soon. Bye. Rick and Dave, congratulations on retirement, or I should say Rick's retirement. I'm sure you'll keep working, Dave. Uh, I just wanted to thank you guys so much for, for everything you guys have done for me. Obviously, um, you guys provided me a, a, a club to work at, allowed me to grow as a coach. Um, to make a lot of mistakes, to learn from those mistakes, but m most importantly, um, you guys allowed me to 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 gain another family. Uh, I loved my time at Oakwood. I loved working for you guys, getting to know you guys and all the other coaches at Oakwood. Um, guys that I still talk to, still that I still love, and I, and and without you guys, that wouldn't have been possible. So, thank you guys. Enjoy your retirement. Try to relax a little bit, Dave, and and uh, I wish you guys all the best. Thanks. Bye. Congratulations, Rick and Dave. This is Tom Richardson, one of your favorite players. <laughs> Just kidding. But I want to thank you guys from the bottom of my heart for all you did for me during my career. I uh, really appreciate you guys. I learned so much from you. And um, I wish you and your families nothing but the best in the future. And I hope to see you guys soon. Take care. There's a hundred thousand things I can think of to say, Rick and Dave. And I've done 900 clips since Bob Boss messaged me a couple of days ago. I'm in this little vestibule in my apartment complex for, you know, it's like a cubicle for studying or something because my, my fiance has kicked me out of the apartment as I've still tried to do this. Because she, if she hears one more time a story about Oakwood and then me switching it, she'll kill me or get rid of me or something. My dad and me, we, my dad and me, rest in peace, dad. We loved you. We followed you, we backed you, we supported you. And I learned, and he knew it, almost everything I didn't learn from him, from you guys. After my father, you're the two most important people in my life. And for those of you who know me and know what I was as a player, a person, and someone that was involved in Oakwood, and as a son, there's nothing that could be a higher honor from someone like me than to say that after my dad, it's you guys. You gave me everything I have, and I love you so much. This is the best I could do because I'm going to ball. I hope that we can talk soon and I can really express what you've done for me or just tell some more stories because Rick, am I right? Am I right? Am I right? I don't know if that's even a good impersonation, but Dave, don't get me started on you. I love you guys so much. It's, it's not even capable to be, to be spoken of the way I feel about this. Legends, legendas, bravo. Champagne for my real friends and real pain for my sham friends. Any corny cliche thing that I could ever think of. You guys taught me how to dream, how to believe, how to be, how to act, how to walk, how to talk, how to win, how to fight, how to scratch, how to claw, how to drag myself up from death and beyond. Every single thing in human characteristic that there is that could be good. I learned at that building from those two men. Your legend, your legenda, legends. 
the best. Simply the best, the GOATs. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for everything. Hey, Dave and Rick, it's Mace here. I just wanted to say thank you for all you guys did for me at Oakwood, you know, provided me such a great place to, to, you know, pursue my passion. You know, I obviously I was younger then, but, uh, uh two beautiful facility at OSP and then, uh, obviously an indoor place and, 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 and your coaching and your mentoring and your development of my character on and off the field. And uh, it just means a lot. All you guys did for me. And I heard that you guys are, are, Move on, on to the next stage of your life and obviously selling Oakland. And I just want to say congratulations for, for that and all that you guys have done for soccer in Connecticut. You guys have been obviously, as I said before, integral and influential in, in my life and playing career. And I definitely wouldn't be able to have said that, you know, I played in the MLS and made it here without you guys. So I just really want to thank you again for everything and, um, all the best in your, your future endeavors. Thank you, Richard.